Highway 14A in Spearfish Canyon offers some of the most picturesque scenery you'll find anywhere in the Black Hills of South Dakota. So this is our first stop. What are we seeing here? Uh, you know, every mountain range has its own Matterhorn. This is Spearfish Canyon. It's called Victoria uh, Tower. It's named that because it was a pretty, uh, you know, relatively uh, unsuccessful mine right adjacent to it named Victoria. Uh, but it's an outcropping that causes the meandering uh, roadway to go around three sides of it to, to get back on, on a creek channel. That's tall. Yeah. How high is that? <laughs> oh, too high to, trick too high to climb. <laughs> oh, there's that airplane over there, about 30,000. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's that high. <laughs> Okay, now Rough Lock Falls is very impressive. This is beautiful. You know, the whole canyon is a sculpture in progress, but over the last 150 years, it's eroded back 300 feet to where you see it now. That uh, seems like a quick erosion um, in only 150 years it would change this much. Limestone. I mean, limestone uh, is very brittle. Uh, it, it's the sedimentation of all those inland seas I once mentioned, and so it uh, erodes very fast. So we've got Spearfish Falls behind us, something I've never seen. This is relatively new for the public. Well, for the last 100 years it's been new. Uh, it's now new again, I should say. Uh, this was, the water was uh, captured by the Homestake Underground Mining Company and tubed over to a hydro plant. And just six years ago, they uh, closed the mine, so the piping no longer happens, so now the water is returned. This falls, Spearfish Falls, used to be twice this large. But because of all the millions of ponderosa pine that are now in the forest competing with the water, only about half of the flow occurs. The other thing that's nice about Spearfish Falls, you can get a little bit of a shower when you come down to see it. <laughs> There's some pretty a, heavy mist going a, on. It's a, it's a great spot in the summer. It's not only cool, but you can get your bath. You know. And this is one of the more scenic drives you're going to find anywhere in the Black Hills. This is one of three scenic byways in South Dakota. Uh, again, I've said it so many times, but what makes this so interesting is that everything is so up close and personal. It really is. And, and people will stop me. We have a million visitors through the canyon each year. People will stop me and say, you know, this is so inspiring to me that I, I, I now believe there's a spirituality of belonging to all who are lured to this grand view. It's, you know, and I live here. That's nice. Yeah, not yeah. bad digs, <laughs> Jerry. To, not bad digs. <laughs> you get to come and do this every day. I do, I do. Well, hopefully our viewers will come. It's, it's not a hard place to find. Spearfish, South Dakota. Highway 14A. 14A off of I-90. Yeah. If you like pretty scenery, you'll like it here. <laughs> <laughs>